God damn it. There we go. Hola, mis queridos. Como estas, mi amor, Alicia? Hello, my kittens. How are you? My name is Austin, and today we're playing Antique Mysteries Secrets of Howard's Mansion. Now, I am not fully aware if this is part of a ser game series or not. I recall going through a bunch of uh, games on Big Fish's website and just looked up games that seemed interesting. And I think, I could be wrong, I think I looked up video games where uh, one of my favorite voice actors is in. I actually cannot remember which ones those were, and I even tried looking it up recently and I could not find the specific list I remember seeing, so who knows uh, if we will find it. I actually could look at the credits to see if this is the correct game or not. Uh, I doubt it's this specific game though, let me check. Okay, it doesn't even tell you the voice actors on here. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Alright, so let me actually get into, I know I'm already talking a bit already, but I do want to let you guys know why I am not playing Knight of the Rabbit or Nancy Drew. I have contacted Gabriel and we are going to be recording, but the reason why I am not playing Knight of the Rabbit this week is because of freaking recording issues. I actually did record one day's worth and ended up finding out that I did not have the game audio on for it, which doesn't make sense because I thought it was working. So that just adds another thing to the list of problems with Night of the Rabbit. <laughs> So, because of all that, Night of the Rabbit will, is officially on the hiatus list. I honestly don't know if I'll be able to get back to it. I will try to contact my brother-in-law, and if he can't figure it out, then I will try to um, perhaps talk to Howdy Folks Gaming, since I know he goes through some recording issues with certain games. <laughs> So maybe he can help me figure it out. I don't know. I'm, I'm at my wit's end with Night of the Rabbit. It's one of my favorite games that I haven't played, but I sincerely want to play for the channel, and it's just not working out. Which really sucks. So this week, instead of Night of the Rabbit and Stardew Valley, I am going to play two games that I've never played before and give my first impressions on them. Because I know I've done that with a couple of other games, and even though I didn't get very many views on them, some people did comment on how hilarious they are, either that or they just, you know, made remarks that I didn't care for, and I'm like, Psh, whatever. Still, they're funny videos. <laughs> and one of them was pretty funny. I could not stop laughing throughout it. I think it was like Hollywood Reporter or something. Anyways, let's get into the game. My name is Seymour, groundskeeper of the Howard's Mansion. Thanks for meeting me on such short notice. You're welcome. You are highly recommended as a top antiques expert and auctioneer. We really need your help at the mansion. Antiques expert and... and but let me first tell you a little about our story. A little basic Meet for the, the background. Late Sheldon okay. Howard's the richest oil man Texas ever produced. He was definitely no internet billionaire. <laughs> Fueled by his fortune, Sheldon collected rare antiques from I'm all around the world to Sheldon. adorn his lavish mansion. This was his great passion. Several years ago, Sheldon completely snapped. From out of the blue, he became obsessed with building secret rooms and passages throughout his Ooh. estate. I was favorite. convinced that if he stopped building them, he would die. He refused to explain what drove him to do so. Ghosts. Shortly before his recent death, he scattered and hid his most prized antique collection all across his estate, including throughout the secret rooms. Booyah! We've called you because we need your help to restore this collection. Why? I've heard you're the best and hope you're up for the oh, challenge. dude. We're approaching the mansion now. Hope you can help us. Good luck. Basic background for the drive and even mess ups on the punctuation. <sighs> All right. My expectations are low now. Welcome. Seymour here again, groundskeeper of the Howard's Mansion. 
Honoured to have your services as antiques expert and auctioneer. Auctioneer. Hey, better, better, swing, better. Oh, wait, no, wrong thing. <laughs> In a final fit of insanity before his death, Mr. Howard's hid his most valued antiques all across this estate. We need your help to restore this gallery collection. Why do I have a feeling you're with the villain? Because seriously, if Mr. Howard's was hiding them for a good reason, I'm betting it's because he didn't want people to steal it. Dude, hello? Here, take this key for the front gate. You'll find many more as you make your way around the grounds. Try not to get too distracted by any oddities you encounter. Our first priority is to restore that gallery. You're on your own from here. Ouch, dude. Okay, so that is quick. That is gonna annoy me. Here are the hints. That's a journal. Ooh, nice. How fortunate I've been to find my true calling in life, the world of antiques and auction sales. My shop here in Texas has done great and earned me the reputation as a top expert in all types of precious collectibles. I'm honored to have been hired to restore the gallery collection hidden here at the Howard's Mansion. Glad to know it will be donated to charity. I've been told it includes its Egyptian and Viking artifacts, and even the wardrobe of a mid-20th century Hollywood star. Yep, ghosts. My only concern is that Sheldon Howard's went insane before he died, building many secret rooms and passages throughout the, his mansion. He inexplicably feared death if he stopped building. I hope this all doesn't rub off on me. Which means... Which means if he is dead, that means he did stop building. Which is unfortunate. And you know what? I think I have ha heard of this guy, Sheldon. There might have been a movie about him. There's even a haunted place that is referring to this. Enter the mansion. Do we actually get to click on these? Because I'm thinking it might be similar to one of the Nancy Drew games. But I like that this is up. This is... This isn't cool. That does remind me of Nancy Drew, by the way. View gallery. Ooh. That is cool. Resume. Um, front garden. Oh, okay. Interesting. Howard's Mansion. They have given me no choice. Interesting. Yeah, that is gonna annoy me. I do like the H on the gate. That's... That's cool. I probably should do that when I get- uh, no, I'm not gonna click hide tutorial tips. Click the scroll and then find all hidden objects on the list. Alright. So it's gonna be one of those. If you can't find a hidden object, just try a hint. Will do. Return to the previous room by clicking the cursor at the bottom of the screen. Will do. Um. That is if I need to. Ooh! I can even exit through the- go in through the entrance. Nice. Runch. Oh, so that means I already clicked it. Uh, Venus flytrap. I actually do know what a Venus flytrap looks like. Um, I'm not finding it. There it is. Pocket watch. Uh, I thought I just saw that. There it is. Found a bonus antique for the auction room. Nice! Letter tiles. Yep. Compass. Um. No. Okay. Oh, hook, hook. Where's the hook? I'm sorry. Every time I hear the hear or see the word hook, that's what I'm going to be saying. A uh, martini glass. Where is that? A martini glass. Shaken. Not stuck. I do not see the martini glass. There it is. By the way, guys, my game, my play on this game will be limited uh, because the two games that I'm going to be playing, I did not purchase. I am only doing like a timed thing for for these two specific games. Um, there's a drill. Hedgehog hourglass flute. Um, oh, that was a sword? Okay. Ooh, I see the scissors now. And I see the, uh, oh, that was a hedgehog. Um, 
There's the flute. Really? Okay. There's the butter tiles. I don't know why I didn't see that before. <laughs> that was pretty obvious. Can I click on this yet? Yes, I can. I... I'm not surprised I didn't see that. Oh, we got a bunch. And we found... An original nice gallery items are collected and placed on display in the gallery room find three more such items to unlock the next area of the mansion oh snappy doodles finding finding these artifacts are important to finishing the game snaps after hidden object scene is completed there may be additional objectives in the scene watch for the sparkles I'm not oh hello can't launch the rocket without the key and microchip. We do not have a key or microchip. Alrighty, daddy then. So, oh, what's this? One of the rocket wings appears broken. Oh, so we need a, need a new wing for the rocket. Nope, I think we're good. Um, oh, hello. Click the map to view your current location in the mansion. Nice. Yeah. Oh, because we unlocked it. Right. And we are right. Yeah. All right. The rocket. Oh, there's a secret room there. Cool. This is definitely a secret room. This is definitely a secret room. That's definitely a secret room. That's definitely a secret room. So is this. And I think this might be a secret room as well. Interesting. If you are stuck anywhere, watch for the occasional sparkles. Looks some buried here. Alrighty then. Door handle. Oh, because it... Okay. Boink. Hey, key. Booyah. Is that everything in this area? Looks like it. Okay. Boink! Was indeed quite batty. Old billionaire dies. Famous Texas oil tycoon Sheldon Howard, known as Shelly by those close to him, has passed away from a heart attack. Oh! Seymour, his groundskeeper of many years, informs us that over the past several years, Sheldon's behavior grew increasingly bizarre and out of control. Howard's became obsessed with building secret rooms and passages throughout his mansion. He refused to explain it. Yeah, he's already told us this. Adding to the tragedy several years ago, Howard's wife was institutionalized for paranoid delusions and passed away while in the hospital. Paranoid delusions? Shoot, it was ghosts! It was just awful to witness Sheldon's mind deteriorating in a similar manner. A cruel coincidence of fate, according to Seymour. Mr. Howards was a well-known antiques collector with an extensive collection. A restoration is currently underway at the mansion prior to the planned estate sale. Interesting. Click here to view your journal entries and for game objectives and hints. You'll find your journal notes along the way. I actually do want to. I already clicked on it. Okay, it checks it off for me. Okay. And it's not giving me any personal thoughts about that article. Alright. Oh, I know what I need to spell. Cuz... Alright. This goes here. Um, that goes there. That goes there. That goes there. Um. Oh boy. Awesome. Yeah. Yep. I've been in a similar situation with that. Also in Nancy Drew. Who was that? I thought that I was all alone in the mission. I'm telling you, 
ghosts! I think I know what I have to do here. <laughs> Wait, who am I trying to get out? The, the red vehicle or the yellow vehicle? Um, what? Can I restart this puzzle? I can. Okay. So, what What I think I have to do... There we go. Okay. There we go. Do this here. Um, there we go. I think it is the red vehicle. Yeah! Great job, you restored the water flow. To what? So first place something here to collect water. Do I have something to collect water? No, I don't. This plant looks like it could use some water. Okay. Interesting. I heard footsteps. And we here here we go with another hidden objects. Alright. Hammer, chalice, uh clock. That looks like a map. A Viking helmet. Interesting. I don't know why I'm having difficulty finding either two Well, I am I understand why I'm having difficulty finding the spider. Considering it's probably a small little thing. But, oh no, there's a spider. So where is the chalice? Oh yeah, okay, so that's understandable. <laughs> Yay! I don't even remember what the items were. Let's go back to the foyer, because I think we can use the teacup. Booyah. And I did not see this before. The key is too high to reach. Can we use the hammer? No. We can use the water on here. Oh! Thank you! Beautiful. Oh, I did not see that before. I must build the room under the stairs for them. They have told me to or else. Please, someone help me. Hmm. Under the stairs, huh? Ooh, and we, not, we need the gear. My dear wife, H.T., whose first and last names sound equally beautiful, read forwards or backwards. Do we know the wife's name? Is it in our journal? What a terrible compulsion to have to follow. Who could Shelly be referring to? No doubt a figment of his distorted imagination. Ghosts! I'm telling you. Ghosts. I heard the footsteps again. Now I know it's more than just a creepy feeling. I'm being watched. Oh, there's hollow eyes. Oh, hey, a key. Hmm. Alright. Um... What? Place the banisters to spell Shelley's wife's maiden name. A painting in the foyer may be of help. H T H T. So we know her first name starts with H, and her last name starts with T. Okay, so her first name is Hannah. Um, no, there's two ends. Yeah! Okay, so T I P P T I. Tippet. 
Um, whoops, no, I, then T. Okay. Hannah Tippett. Nice. What is this? Ooh. Ooh. All right, I think I might actually buy the game because this actually looks pretty cool. Um, I think this is supposed to go here. So we need two more gears. I have done as you asked and built you this room according to your deranged spec. I trust you are appeased. Please don't torment me any longer. <laughs> oh, this poor guy. So is there anything else? Some gears are missing here. Yes, I know. Uh, connect lines between each node, creating a single continuous path. Lines cannot cross each other or the block at the bottom, can, and can only be formed in straight or diagonal paths in the grid. Each node can only be used once. Oh! I think I'm familiar with this. It's also used in one of the Nancy Drew games. Forms in straight, straight or diagonal lines. I know that. Okay, which means I cannot go down, because there's nothing else that'll meet, meet across. Shoot, I think I might have messed up. Unless that's the last place we're supposed to go. Oh, I can't cross any previous paths. Well, what the butts? I think I might actually have to skip the puzzle because I have honestly no idea. I'm neither full on food or so I don't have any I don't have complete brain power to do this challenge so yeah it's not complete di completely diagonal for doodles so how am I supposed to do this I think I might actually have to skip all right I'm I'm skipping sorry everyone <laughs> Uh, alrighty. There must be something special about this stone. Alrighty then, a little fire might come in handy here. A uh, Viking helmet encased in resin. Rocket hand rocket key crank handle cra oh oh do i already have the thing for the rockets okay well i do have the rocket key i need the m microchip and plus i need a new wing for the rocket ship Oh, now I know where that footsteps are, are, are coming from. It's from me. Oh, really? Oh! I did not notice a stone hinge there. Hello. Let me guess. Microchip? Oh, that's a lighter. I do see some Christmas lights up there. Interesting. All right, so we do have a lighter, so that's good. Uh, let's go in here and over here. Oh yeah, let's use the lighter. All right, I am running out of time, so I'm trying to pick pick my pace up a little bit. <laughs> oh, our character is a guy. Uh, why would Sheldon go through the enormous effort of building this strange room? Who could it be for? It doesn't make any sense to me. I have done as you asked. Oh yeah, this stuff. It will soon! Ghosts, I tell you! Ghosts! The rocket blast should be... Should pretty much melt anything on this table. Oh, we're under the rocket! 
A front row seat to a rocket blast was a most unreasonable demand, yet I have complied. Your coercion has cost me a small fortune money which could have gone to a much better cause. I hope you are proud. Shelly. Interesting. Cabinet is locked. I thought I had an extra key, but apparently I don't. How am I supposed to melt? Oh. Okay. Oh! That unlocked this! Hey, the microchip! Alright, now we have everything. Sweet. You know what? I think the rocket ship might be our last thing to do. Booyah. And the rocket ship. And then, na 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 And our favorite rocket ship. Moving on. Oh, it has no fuel source. Where the frick are we going to get gas? Some gears are missing that I understand. I don't think anyone could survive witnessing the blast off from this perspective under the rocket. They'd be incinerated. Yeah, again, my theory, ghosts. Oh, that's what it meant. Cause it meant the secret room was gonna lead to here. Okay. Cause like the, a, a lot of time I'm allowed to play a game for, well, for certain games is 60 minutes roughly. And it took me a minute to get everything set up before I can record. And then having to open it again. I can go to the auction room. We'll open once you find several bonus auction items. Oh. So I found the Hollywood Starlet. And the Civil War item. Used during the Battle of Gettysburg. This collection is not complete. Oh. Fabu Famous wardrobe items worn by Marilyn Monroe. Interesting. Oh, I did not see that. Rocker fuel flow. All right. Place the blocks to completely fill the rocket shape on the board. You can rotate a piece by selecting it and then clicking the button on the left. All the blocks must be used. Um, so at this point, I've wasted a lot of time trying to figure out what I'm supposed to do next. I did not see that area of the room until now. <laughs> until, like, probably five or ten minutes later. And I don't have much time left. Um, so can I right-click to rotate? No, I cannot. Oh, I can rotate them. Mmm. <clears throat> I do not have much time, guys. But what does that mean I can do here? Oh, oh, oh! Yes! Alright, so that is good. Everything's good. Basically, what we're going to be seeing last is the rocket ship. Basically. All right, everything's good. We can now hit lunch. What's the what's the line? We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship, zooming through the sky. I wish I could know the words. I wish I knew the words to that. Looks like the room under the rocket was incinerated. Yay! Now let's go to that room and find out what that skull looks like. Ugh. Holy sh shit! Hockey mushrooms. I was about to curse. Ooh, what's that? Painting key! Yes! Found an ancient Viking helmet. Yes! Alright. Alright. I'm actually gonna... I know we need one more, but I want to find out where that Viking helmet... There we go. Worn and used by Leif Erikson. I don't know that. I don't know that name. I feel like I should. <laughs> I'm definitely going to be looking the- Yes! We got a gear! Oh no. Launch pad after launch. 
Oh, right there. I cannot believe I didn't see that. All right, this will definitely be the last thing we can do. Whoa, look at that. Diamond necklace. Whoa, what's that key for? Whoa, new area available. Grand Salon. Yes. Just checking in on your progress. Happy to see the gallery restoration is going well. Now, I don't mean to offend, but I should mention that you are not here in any investigative capacity, so please only concern yourself with your official work. Hope that's clear. It is clear. We're not going to abide by that rule, though. Because <laughs> seriously, we want to know what the heck is going on. We still can't go to several bonus auction items. I'm betting we actually have to clear out one collection in order to get to the auction room. Um, so we have that, but it does look like we are out of time. So, with that ado, I'm gonna go to the main menu. And this definitely makes me want to buy the game. So, I am definitely gonna try to save up some money. Right now, my funding is not very good. I made some stupid purchases. One was worth it though, because it's for my sister's birthday. Uh, that happened last month. I told her it was going to be a late present. Now I know that I'm going to be buying this game. So that is exciting. Anyways, my beautiful kittens, I think that's going to be it. I really enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed this game. There are some issues of it that I don't like, uh, like how quick that and in the inventory open up is like. The voice actor does seem to be really good. I don't think it's the voice actor I'm thinking of, although I'm sure he could do Southern American accent. I've never actually heard him do an, an American accent, actually. I am excited, though. This game is a lot of fun. Story-wise, it's definitely got my interest. The graphics are actually pretty good. As far as, like, the opening scene, though, that could have been done a lot better. Like, the background was just not matching up with the movement of the car and they could have picked a better background for that, actually. The groundskeeper does have some sus suspicion. I think he might be in on with the ghosts. And I still believe that it's ghosts. The, the auctioneer is right. No one would survive that blast. And if that's the case, then it has to be someone who's already dead that would be able to see it. Either that, or there's another secret room attached to that where they could see the blast. Or... Or it's the people who live inside those items that he hid. Because the, the Viking helmet would have had a great view of that blast. Interesting. That's actually an interesting theory. But anywho, I'm going to have to buy this game to find out if my theory is correct. Because <laughs> seriously, that is so cool. Anywho, that it will have to be it. I'm literally at the end of my... Uh, well, not literally, but I'm really close to finishing up my, my time frame on this video. So, thank you so much, my beautiful kittens. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did, because I know that is insane. And, and on, on that, that note, note, I hope you all enjoyed this video. And if so, smash that like button like a kitten would. And if you're just now tuning into this channel by watching this video, go ahead and click, click, click that ugly red subscribe button. Make it that beautiful gray, as well as the bell icon right next to it. That'll notify you of all the videos that I do, which are uploaded Tuesdays and Thursdays, Fridays or vlog days, rarely Sundays. And I hope you all have a great morning, afternoon, evening, or nights wherever you are in the world. I am Sweet Rascally Rabbit saying goodbye. Stay awesome and stay on YouTube! I really am looking forward to purchasing this game. Oh, I can't stop guessing what's gonna happen next.